What's up? What's up? What's up, people? Got some new cards. Actually, you should have these before. Oh, it says proceeding softly. I'm sorry. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Where are my manners this morning? Good morning from Anchorage, Alaska. What's up, people? So I got these new cards yesterday, and I used to have them before, and I got more, and I said, let me get these, because I miss these. They're from De Denise Lynn, which is amazing. My inner power grows in moments of quiet tide. Quiet tide? Ooh, quietude. I'm sorry, quietude. When you're quiet. When you're quiet. Proceeding soft. Look, look, look at that cup of tea. Look at that cup of tea. Ooh, that's a sign. I gotta go get some chai. Anyways, another card. Renewing your life. Clear the clutter, bitches. Sorry, am I saying bitches again? What's the matter with me? I'm sorry. People think when I say bitches, I'm like cursing at them, but no, that's just the way I talk, people. Okay, I should just say clear the clutter, biatches. Does that sound better? I think so. Anyways, yeah, clear the clutter, right? You must clear the clutter to start new, right? Radiant vitality is filling my life. Clear the clutter. That's what I did yesterday. I got rid of a lot of stuff because I'm going to be moving soon, God said. So you better just start donating, girl. And I did. I don't have much, but because I live as a, as a minimalist, I don't have much. But I do have some stuff that I really didn't need that I bought. So I'm trying to get rid of it. Like pots and pans because I don't even cook for real. I mean, I do, but not like I used to. So, yeah. Receiving from angels. Shimmering wings of angels embrace me with love. Aww. I love my angels. I'm hearing. I love you, too. I love you, too, Angel Gabriel. Where are my manners this morning? What is wrong with me? I haven't had any chai, any coffee. I don't know what is going on here, people. What is going on here? I don't know, but I love my cards. Mm, taking action. I enthusiastic, enthusiastically embrace life's boundless possibilities. I love these cards. You know why? They're simple and you can understand them. And I love them. Oh, stepping into stillness, right? My power is born in the majesty of silence. Yeah. Thank you, Archangel Michael. Thank you. Thank you, ancestors. I got Jesus coming in. Thank you, Jesus. He's like, thank you, my child, for, for sharing your, sharing the cards by, it's called Gateway Oracle Cards by Denise Lynn. Yeah. I miss my cards. I also got a new deck of my um, angel answers because my other deck I've had for a while and it, it something spilled on it, you know. And I've had it for like five years and I just wanted to get another deck and I'm feeling guilty to get rid of that deck, but it's okay. I just got a new deck. It's the same deck, but I just wanted the cards not to be wet. I mean, they did dry, but I don't like the way they dried because something fell on them for real. So anyways, and I got another deck also. You know where it's, oh, it's, it's this one. I used to have this before and I donated it. It's called the Soul's Journey. So we're going to pull a card from there too. But anyways, what's next? Sorry about that. Starting fresh. Yep. A wonderful new beginning is blossoming, blossoming in my life. Many men, I can't talk this morning. I'm sorry if I'm stuttering. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> You're going to be starting a new beginning. Everything's going to be new. I'm seeing a new house, either a new apartment, new condo, new car, even a new dog because your dog, you used to have a dog before, you don't anymore. Either a new dog or a cat. A new lover. Ooh, you get married, girl. Or guy that's what I'm getting new and fresh is so beautiful but I'm getting don't make the same mistakes you, you did last time girl or boy 
don't live in the past. No, 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 no. Standing firm, right? I am noble, brave, and strong because you can do this. You can do this. It's up to you. Like I always say, guys, it's up to you to, to have a good marriage. It's up to you to have a good relationship. It's up to you. It's in your hands, you know? What you give is what you get. But is that always true though, right? Because sometimes you give too much and people take ad advantage of you. So give with discernment. I'm not saying don't give. Give the people that really love and deserve it. Give your love to the people who really deserve it. Don't give your love to the people that don't deserve it. You understand? And and you will know. You will know this, you know? I'm getting a cold. Oh, stand. Hmm. Childlike wonder fills in my life. Oh, look at the soaring and joy. Yep. So once you start your new beginning and you're standing firm... And you're starting fresh, you will be like this, right? Soaring in joy. All these messages are from Divine this morning, guys. And then let's do a journey, a soul's journey card, real quick, because I have to go catch the bus real quick. Anyways, but I wanted to do this before I went on my journey today. It's another one. One, two. Okay, this one relationships Ooh, i am attracted to those people who serve my highest good yep what do you think about that yep awesome another one they said peace right you will be getting a lot of peace right once you start your new beginning and you forget the past and you don't live in the past anymore you know because the past doesn't do nothing for you you know but as soon as you let go of your past, let go of the clutter, declutter your toxic relationships with friends, family. And I'm not saying all family is bad. Please don't get me that way. Not all family is bad. Just because my family was effed up doesn't mean your family is going to be messed up. But I'm just saying, you know, just let go of the clutter, declutter your life, detoxify it, you know, start a new beginning. Because once you start a new beginning and you stand in your own power and you stand firm and then you start a new beginning, right? And then you get peace, right? Within yourself because everything's new, new is going to be great, right? You know why? Because because God loves you, man. God loves you, you know? He will never guide you wrong, but you got to listen to your intuition. You got to listen to your intuition, guys. I'm saying one more card. Patience. I love these cards. Patience. I accept that everything happens in divine order. Uh-huh. I was just going to say it's divine timing, right? You will find your new new, whoever he is or she is. You will, but you got to do work on yourself. And I hope you're doing work on yourself, you know? You know how you do your work on yourself? You focus on yourself first. And once you focus on yourself first, you'll find your match. You know, and please let the universe know what you want. I got this book the other day. It's called, I forgot the name of it now. I think it's, um, it's about soulmates and it's like stories of soulmates, how they get together just like that. And I'm going to read you a story. I don't have time today, but I'm going to read you a story when I get back today from it. It's a little long, but I'm going to try to read it. I'm going to try to cut it out. I'm going to try to read it really quick simplifying your life yeah i sh i cherish i cannot talk this morning god i cherish the simple pleasures of life see she's decluttering her life she's getting all the toxicity and all the toxic people away from her life that don't do any justice to her right and it comes back to relationships right i am where's my relationship card <laughs> and it comes back to relationships right I'm attracted to those people who serve my higher good, right? She's going to get rid of the people that don't do her any good, meaning that are negative, that, that, that are shunting against her, that don't give a crap about her or him, whoever this person is. It doesn't matter about the gender, you know, he or she, you know. But I'm just saying that, um, yeah, all the cards are beautiful this morning. Anyways, guys, I hope you have a good day. Namaste, namaste, and I swear I'm gonna try to stop cursing because God had a talk with me last night. He was like, 
Divinity, Angel Gabriel, what's the matter with you? Why are you cursing so much? He says, I must have coffee or tea, at least three cups only. Either three cups of coffee or three cups of tea, but I can't have both. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Anyways, and he goes, no cursing. No cursing, or you're going to lose your blessings. I'm like, what? Can I curse an Indian? He's like, no. I'm like, why? He's like, no. I'm like, why? And he shook his head. He's like, I don't know what to do with you. I said, I love you, Jesus. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Anyways, I hope you have a wonderful Friday. And remember, God loves you, and you better love yourself.